Bill Maher suggested Joe Biden consider replacing his VP, Rob, if you have this video, replacing, replacing his VP, Kamala Harris, with Nikki Haley or Republican Senator Mitt Romney in a bit to bit bridge the divide between the political parties. Go on and play this, Rob. Um, I know it's crazy to think that she could run with Biden, but that's my dream, well, a <laughs> unity ticket. And then he would, I think, definitely win because nobody's going to. And of course, she said some crazy things. Mm. Most politicians have not as crazy as we've never been a racist country. I mean, that's pretty crazy. Wow. <laughs> literally destroy the, Repu uh, the Democratic base. I mean, take no, off the really? first African-American mm. female vice she's, president. She's office a again. woman of color. Wink, yeah, wink. What a, but what it's just like idiot. black women are what? like the yeah, core I, I of the it. Democratic Party. Correct. Like what a what a douchebag. Like what a do because Bill Maher apparently, you know, to him, the first woman of color, Kamala Harris, is just a placeholder. Like this is what this is. This is what I'm talking about, about Bill Maher, bro. Just when you think he's starting to turn and he's like, then he goes right back into being a vampire. I, I was just saying their guy is losing. And so the lunacy that comes to the end of De Niro's statement is not surprising to me, nor is it the And listen to the last thing he said. Bill Maher goes, and then he would win. Their guy is losing, and so he is solving for Biden winning. You know, if Nikki Haley was on here, and Biden would win. That's what he's solving for. These are desperate people groping and, and looking for desperate, you're literally groping in the dark, desperately trying to find a solution. How are they getting away Wayne? with groping? I mean, this is the kind of stuff that... No. It, it, <laughs> What, well, this, we, is, this is Hollywood. It's very, it's very literally. Tom, he's a literally, he's a literal man. There's no way in the world Bill Maher and these guys can get away with groping but, until the Me Too movement would get him. Is that, is that what is that you're what saying, saying with, Tom? With the they, they, they are metaphorically groping <laughs> in the dark. Metaphorically, for a way, metaphorically. For a way I never read the Rob. Never gave me yeah. a story about Bill Maher but, groping. But, but go ahead. But, but, no, but that, does that surprise you? It's no. everything. Groping? Hey, wait a minute. Of course, how, it would how can Biden win? How can Biden win? We'll arrest Trump. We'll get all these things. How can Biden win? You know, we. You know, we, uh, oh, I got an idea. Nikki Haley replaces Kamala Harris because she's so unpopular. We'll put a more popular person and then Biden would win. It, but it, does this all surprise you? But there's, no, but, but this they're is the solving one, for their guy to win. That's but not this, surprising. This is the one thing that's bothering me. And they're crazy, me. which is equally unsurprising. The, the one thing that Pull bothers up. me about the, the left and the down. Democrats is the proof is in the pudding. This past three years and however many months, Name me one thing that's going right. And p please, please don't don't tell me infrastructure because the majority of people have no idea what the hell they're talking about. Nothing has gone right from Afghanistan to the border. to you, The list goes on and on and on and on. But you know what? They would rather have the country go to shit than have Donald Trump. That's think about the mentality. We'd rather have a burning house. I want it to fall down just as long as this person is not in charge. It's lunacy. Like I can give a shit if I, if I was on the left. But what's this? Oh, so Donald Trump this is, is first. Tom, don't look. Tom, oh, don't, don't look. look. Don't look. Tom, Tom. Oh, I mean, forget Tom, it. Do you speak English? He looked too fast. He was looking. I don't look. He's like. Go ahead. <laughs> Go ahead, Adam. Do <laughs> can't So what? I, what? I, I don't know what Canadian thing you're doing over uh -oh. there. Again. That By was, the way, that was uh -oh. German. You we, idiot. We have our thousand dollar bet. I said that Biden is going to be the nominee. Yes. Clearly, since the State of the Union address where they set the bar so low that as long as Joe Biden survived the speech <laughs> that, you know, they think he's going to do okay. When we last looked at this, Michelle Obama was 9 to 1. It is now double. She's 18 to 1. Holy Gavin Newsom was, I think, 12 to 1. Well, That's gone up a little 14. bit. Would you at least acknowledge that at least since the State of the Union that it is now more likely than ever that Biden will in fact be the nominee? Or are you still clinging to your August surprise Prediction. Uh, I'm not clinging to my August. I'm not clinging to anything. I'm objectively looking at everything. And when you and I made a bet, that's how I feel. I still think it's possible. I'm going to honor my bet. I'm going to hand you a check made out to wounded check. warriors for a thousand bucks. No, no, you're giving me the money and what I choose to do with it, whether I choose to. Why do you hate wounded warriors? I love wounded that. warriors. <laughs> I might take your money and double it. That's not what yeah. I'm saying. You're not going to take a check for a thousand bucks. You don't, you don't so make you're not going to take a check for a thousand bucks made out to wounded warriors. I think that's, that's horrifying. Not, that's not what I'm saying. No, it's a, I don't know, I don't know if that gonna, was the initial I'm bet. Gonna, and and I'm gonna, was, have you, had a, the bet. I'm have you had a bad experience with wounded warriors in the past? No. Your, I've, is this, I, I don't, I don't uh, trust a lot of listen. 501c3s. I like to see where the money goes. I'd rather give it to them myself. Yeah. But I'll tell you this. The chances of him replacing uh, Kamala Harris, who is astronomically horrible, is zero. 
uh, the the base of the Democratic Party are black women. They're not going to replace at this juncture the first African American woman, whatever Indo Indo Pacific woman ever to become vice president. By the way, the most happening. interesting thing about this is the fact that Gavin officially pulled above Michelle. Yeah, Obama. yeah. that's weird. That's the most interesting yeah. thing. That that flipped. That's very place. weird. But, but uh, listen, yeah. if and you nailed There's it, Adam. Still he nailed time it. for a stroke. Whatever drug adrenaline they injected into Biden at the State of the Union, if they do that every debate. He does have a, I mean, he has a chance to survive. I don't think he'll beat Trump, but he'll make it through the he debate. He looked good at that. He looked good. Like, he, it's like if he had a doctor or maybe a family member that knew a lot about medications. Yeah. Could, oh, yeah. wait. Oh, yeah. Weird. <laughs> this is what we're going to do. Anybody that places an order of, let's say, $50 or more, minimum one future looks bright hat. Because I want a million people this year wearing this gear. There were so many people in the arena independently wearing the Future Looks Bright gear. Mm -hmm. And it's so confusing for people who are pessimistic when they see somebody say the Future Looks Bright. But this is what I'm going to do. Anybody that places an order of, uh, uh, you know, $50 or more, okay, between now and Thursday. But specifically, anyone that places an order, every for every $50 you place an order, you get one ticket in the drawing. And I'm going to get... I don't know. I'm going to get four tickets to the next UFC fight. Wow. Okay. I don't even know where the next UFC fight UFC is. UFC 300. And I'm going to give two people two UFC tickets. Rob, if you can give me those. Sam, just bring it to me. Just bring it to me. It's okay. And here's what we got. These are the things that we have right now for International Women's Day. We just got these pink. Uh, 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 oh, look at that. Yeah. Pink Future Looks Bright hats that are here. Sam, are these on the site? So Rob hats. Let's make sure they're on the site. We got these two future looks uh, bright uh, women's hat, pink, to choose from. And then Love we got that. the new navy blue. Navy blue, if you're like a police officer, we got the new navy blue future looks bright. Let's make sure. And these are on the site. Rob, can you show these things being on the site? You place the order of the hats. Oh, that blue is sick. $50 or more. For every $50, we're going to do a drawing. And on Thursday, I'm giving away four mm -hmm. UFC tickets. That, that's the wow. one, right? The navy blue. And then, uh, Samuel, I don't know if I see the pink one on there. So if you can make sure that gets on there as well. But uh, that's what we're going to do. Make sure you place your order. Okay. It's uh, April 13th, Las Vegas. Perfect. UFC there you go. April 13th, month. Las Vegas. I'm going to give away four tickets. So if you like this clip and you want to watch another one, click right here. And if you want to watch the entire podcast, click right here.